What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to another video. In this video I want to solve this trigonometric equation, which is secant squared theta minus 2 tan theta equals to 4. First thing I'm going to do, I'm, I need to have this to the same function. We know secant squared theta equals to 1 plus tan squared theta. We have it from trigonometric identities. If you don't remember that, just go and find it in trigonometric identities playlist i will leave the link in below in case you want to find out the trigonometric identities here so secant squared theta equals to one plus tan squared theta so that's going to be one plus tan squared theta minus two tan theta equals to four so then i will say that tan squared theta minus 2 tan theta minus 3 equals to 0. Why? Because you move this one in here, it's going to be negative 4. Here we have 1, it's going to be negative 3. So then I have a quadratic equation. I need to solve it. We can use either um, uh, quadratic formula or we can solve it by factoring. If you solve it by factoring, we have two numbers, multiply to negative 3 and add to negative 2. So it's going to be 10 theta minus 3 times tan theta plus 1 equals to 0. It means that tan theta either equals to 3 or tan theta equals to negative 1. So here we have theta to be tan inverse 3 and here we have theta equals to pi minus pi over 4 and 2 pi minus pi over 4. So basically, I can find out the tan inverse of 3. It is going to be 71.5 degrees or 1.25 radian. And here we have 1.25 radian, 3 pi over 4, and 7 pi over 4. This is going to be the three answers when we are looking for theta between 0 and 2 pi. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave me a comment if you have any question. Thank you for watching and have a great day.